previously on Celebrity Big Brother. Twelve new housemates entered the house, with Sunita being challenged to become the queen of the house. She successfully passed her task and became head of house. Also, Bagger nearly killed an adjudicator. Sunita also nominated Ed and Jake. But tonight, we continue with day three, where the house is converted to an old people's home, and either Ed or Jake will go, and the housemates become carers for the day. This is Celebrity Big Brother. Day 3, 9.15pm. All of the housemates have now returned back to the living quarters, where Big Brother will be announcing the next task. This is Big Brother, housemates. For the next few days, day 3, day 4 and day 5, your task will be for certain housemates to become carers, and for certain housemates to become the elders. There will be three carers. The, the most successful carer will win immunity from the next eviction. The elders will be deciding who the best and successful carer will be out of these three. The following three housemates will be the carers for the next few days. These carers will have to look after all the housemates and provide housemates with a meal, look after them, feed them, and loads more to be revealed soon. The following housemates are the carers, Jenny, Nigel and Joan. Please may those housemates go to the bathroom to change. In each cubicle, Jenny, Nigel and Joan are dressing up as the carers. God, I think I look horrible. Mm, I don't like it. You look alright, to be honest. I mean, it's just a blue uniform with a blue face mask on. I can't even breathe right now. Because I I have to I have to swallow the face mask. Oh, stop complaining. You look beautiful anyway. Says you, Nigel. How dare you be such a creep? I'm not being a creep. In the garden, Jake and Ed. You know, I uh, I wish you the best of luck for tomorrow, because you never know. You or I could be going and, I mean, we haven't had a long time in here to bond with everyone here. I totally agree with you. Yeah, um, but really, I wish you the best. Yeah. Um, you know what I heard? Apparently we can vote. I thought we weren't allowed to vote. Hmm? Maybe it's just a one-off. Yeah, I think it might be a one-off. One off special, as they say. <laughs> yeah. Um, no, it's quite freezing outside. I, I totally agree. I'm a bit cold right now. Um, what, what, what do you think they look like? They probably look like carers. That is true. I wonder what we'll be doing. I mean, we'll probably be looked after, that's all. Yeah, probably. I'm quite excited for it, to be honest. Um, no, not really for me. But then, I'd rather look after myself rather than be looked after. But then, you can't... You can't do that. You can't look after yourself. I know. I hate the carpet, though. It's horrible. Brown carpet with red carpetness. Horrible. <sighs> 10.14pm, 
the task is ready to begin. This is Big Brother. Jenny, Joan and Nigel and the elders. You will begin your tasks now. Remember, elders, you will be deciding the best carer. One will be eliminated tomorrow. Who will it be? Elders, you decide. Begin tasks now. Um, can I have some milk, please, Jenny? Um, okay, yeah, sure. 12.07am. Bagger has been called to the diary room. Hello, Bagger. Hi, big brother. How are you, Bagger? Yeah, I'm fine, fine, thank you. Now, Bagger, as you know, recently you failed your task yesterday. And by failing your task, you have been punished, meaning that you will no longer be able to nominate. However, you will not be sleeping in the bedrooms. You will be sleeping in the living area where the lights will remain on. Oh, God, no, I don't want to. Bagger? Yes. This will remain until further notice. Oh, God. Bagger? Yes. Do you have anything to say? Um, God, help me. Thank you, Bagger. You may return back to the house. The last housemates who should be going to bed are the carers. The last housemate to go to bed is Joan. She is closing up the kitchen. Good night, Bagger. Good night, Joan. Have a nice sleep. I don't think I will. Would you like tucking up? Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. You can tuck me up. Good night, all. Good night. Sleep tight. Thanks. You too. God, it feels odd without a bed beside me. I feel absolutely empty that I don't think I'll sleep. After the break, housemates continue with the old people task. And either Jake or Ed will go. <laughs> Day 4, 7.09am. The carers are already up. Now, what do we have to make? So, we need to make eight meals, is it? So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, eight meals. So, what, what would be the easiest? I think we should go for hospital food. So, we should have... Um, healthy meals for them and then they'll start to complain a bit and then hopefully they won't like this house and they won't like the tasks that they'll start revolting. Um, yeah, actually, that is a good idea. What should we make them? Uh, normal beans. Okay, okay, I'll have a look in the storage room then. In the bedroom, Bagger has snuck into Nigel's bed, meaning that she has broken one of Big Brother's rules and she will be punished more. 11.04am. All of the housemates are at the breakfast table. Okay, listen up, stupid people of the elder. Now, I'm off to feed you. Well, I'm not off to feed you. Nigel is only off to feed you, spoon feed you. He's the only one who's offered to spoon feed whilst Jenny is deciding to hide behind there because she's scared of all of you. Now, what we're feeding you is beans and porridge and water. You've got to understand that we're from the elderly age except Jenny. We were fed rubbish food 
and you will be fed rubbish food. We also want to get rid of it, so that's why we thought feeding you this. So, enjoy. Bottoms up. Nigel is the only carer to spoon feed and water the housemates. Here you go. Have a sip on that. And have a... And here's the choo choo train. Choo choo. Oh, well done. Well done. Who wants feed next, guy? Here comes choo choo train. Choo choo. Oh, well done. Well done. Would you like some water? Splish splash. Here goes the water. You know, you. By the way, I'm off to, uh, I don't like you. Why not? Because you're treating us like children. We're elderly. I want to revolt. There we go. We got the revolt. What did you say, June? Nothing. I did not say anything. I mean, I am feeding you, so I'm caring for you. That is true. Good point well made. Three hours later, Bagger has been called to the diary room. Hello, Bagger. Hi, big brother. Bagger, today at 6.07am, you were seen sneaking into the male bedroom where you snuck into Nigel's bed. Yes. Now, this is a rule-breaking situation and as a result you will be punished more you will be sitting outside in the cold for the next two hours with just a coat and nothing else not even my trousers just a coat on with trousers and some shoes as well Oh, God. Why? Why did it have to be me? Why? You may go to the garden immediately. Oh. Where are you going, bagger? Um, I'm, I'm going outside. I've been told to go outside for a few hours by Big Brother and told not to enter the Big Brother house until told to. All right. Foot massage. Head massage. I want a head massage. I'll give you it. Thanks, Joan. Uh, can I have a foot massage, please? You never know. It might be my final day, so, yeah. Yeah, will do. Thank you, Jenny. I, d I don't think anyone needs my services, then. Okay, I'm off outside, then. Bye. Bagger is all by herself in... The smoking hut. God, it is freezing. God, I don't like it. I might twiddle my thumbs. Twiddly, twiddly do. Twid, twid, twiddly diddy. Twiddly, diddly do. Do, do. Twiddly, diddly do. Five minutes later. Nigel has joined Bagger outside. You all right, Bagger? Uh, no, not really. Would you like warming up? Oh, yeah, if, if you don't mind. I'll keep you warm if you want. I mean, I don't have anything else to do in there. I mean, none of us do other than give people massages, massage on the head, all of that. <laughs> yeah. Now, how are you feeling? Yeah, I'm good, thank you. Uh, I mean, I just hate that I've been forced to sleep in uh, the main area because the lights never turn off, don't they? I thought they would. Isn't that, like, abusement from Big Brother? I guess not. It's just a punishment. And what they've told me is that I can't vote at all. Can't vote. Or evictions can't do anything. Mm. 
that is quite odd to be honest i mean i'd i'd love to vote but then i i think i'm allowed to vote this eviction though so maybe i am <laughs> anyhow um yeah just keep me warm i mean i've got extra layers if you want it oh yeah i'll have a face mask on yeah sure have it <laughs> 2.39 p.m. All of the housemates have been called to the living area and Joan, Jenny and Nigel have been told to line up. The housemates have voted on their best carer to their least favourite carer. The housemates have decided that Jenny is their least favourite carer. She will face punishments by Big Brother and will be sleeping in the main area of the house. Oh, at least I've got someone with me. That is true. Mm. Oh well, happy to say that I am not safe. 9.30pm Ed and Jake are up for the eviction and Grass Monster is ready to speak to the house. Big Brother House, this is Grass Monster. Ed and Jake. For the past 24 hours, the housemates have been voting to evict and I can now reveal that the first person to be evicted with eight to three votes is Ed. Ed, you have been evicted. <sighs> oh well, there he is. He's gone. I mean, he left in a bit of an angry mood, but oh well, what can we do? Nothing, I guess. I mean, I'm quite happy that he's gone. That is true. I mean, it was a bit boring. I, I, I didn't mind him, to be honest. Well, you say that because you were up against him. And I don't know how you got the vote. I don't know either. 12.11am. <sighs> it's time for the housemates bed. And Jenny is now sleeping outside. Whilst the rest of the housemates are sleeping in their beds. Good night all. Night night. Sleep tight. You too.